Hello friends, welcome back. This is Manish Pandey. This is another video of calendar business object. Now, I am going to show you how to use get other holidays in range. This action we are going to use that is a part of business object. So, let me take one action, double click on that select calendar business object and now select get other holidays in range now what is other holidays so you can consider like we have working days non working days right based on this region it means based on this country we have usa so these are the holidays that we are getting let me click on this and you can see we have 10th of october that is columbus day from this USA client 11, 11 21 veterans day we have holiday now there is some date which is actually not holiday but sometime we have to make that as a holiday so from this right section we have other holidays it means add any other non working days to apply to this calendar so we already have 31st 12 17 these days that is a public holiday and saturday and sunday we have for non working days right now if you want to add so let's say today is 16 and today is saturday so this is not working day right now let's say you want to mark this 18 also as a holiday but actually that is not holiday that is not public holiday but that we can say as a other holidays based on the region if you see in india also we have few fixed next national holiday and there are few holidays that we get as a regional holidays like that so we can consider that as a other holiday so let's say i'm going to click on this 18th october so this 18 october we are also considering this as a holiday but that is not public holiday that is other holiday so let me now select 18 and 19 now click add so we have two days that is other holiday you can mark multiple you can go to november and december you can mark anything so we have two more other holidays save that so we have option get other holidays in range so we can first get all the other holidays that we have in our that has specific date range so in this one our calendar name first we need to enter usa calendar and our first date is let's say i'm going to enter here today and last date i'm going to enter 31st october 2021 go to output click on other holidays now this other holidays is type of collection it means it will give us date all the other holidays that we have here we will get in our collection if we have multiple we will get all the multiple holidays between that given date range now click ok go to this link this right click right click set next stage step into now you'll see here in this other holidays we are getting row one of two it means we are getting two that is the date of the other holiday defined on this calendar go to the current values and you can see here we have 18 and 19 these two dates are other holiday right so by this way we can get other holidays if we have in our calendar i hope this is also useful for you please like this video and please subscribe this channel if you have not subscribed it and thank you so much for watching this video